but my mom built a new fireplace yesterday for the Halloween party, and it was pretty good. It was some rocks, sheet metal, um, all that, and we decided to test it last night, have a little fire, and it was pretty good. After we were done, we splashed some water on it, make sure there's no more fire, of course. But I guess somehow, uh, the fire snuck under the fireplace, and, um, it was down there for a couple hours after we were even done with the fire, surprisingly. There's a fire building up in, in the bottom. And, um, a couple hours after the fire, it was like almost midnight, um, we get, we get a knock at our door. I answer it. It's our neighbor, thankfully. He told us that there's a fire in our backyard. So I was like, oh shoot. I came running out here. I uh, made the mistake of not waking up my mom because I was pretty scared. Because it may not look like much. But like when the fire was still going, it looked big. It looked like it was basically covering like half of the gazebo. Um, so I grabbed a bucket, tried filling it with water. Tried getting the hose, tried turning the knob, of course, now is the time it didn't work for me. Tried turning the thing, no water was coming out, so just waited for the bucket to fill up. Didn't even fill it up all the way because it takes up too long. Came running over through there, right there, and splashed the water on, splashed water on the fire right here. And there's still a lot of fire right here. And a little bit right over there. So, my neighbor comes over to help us. Um, he gets the hose, dries it for a little bit, and it starts working again. It starts spraying all over. <laughs> Burnt the rug right here. See the, the burn marks. Obviously burned all this wood. Here. Thankfully it was just a little bit, so we could probably fix that. Burnt this right here. Bit of melted plastic. And that's what's left of the fireplace. My mom had to tear it apart to see if there was any more fire down there. So it didn't spread again. So yeah, last night was fun. Had a fire in our backyard. Now we'll have to use the old fireplace again. Because the new one. Um, yeah. Um, now I'm going to show a video of. Like right after the fire basically. The fire was still even going on. I didn't get a video of when the fire was big of course. Because I wasn't focused on recording it. But this is a video of when the fire was still kind of little and we were still trying to put it out. You can see all the smoke. I'm sorry. Um, the video is kind of dark because, of course, it was at night. And I couldn't use my flashlight because, of course, my phone was very low, very low battery. So it's kind of dark, but it's the best I got. There was, like, tons of smoke. Like, my neighbor smelled it from where he, w where he was. Like, so much smoke coming out from this kind of little fire. Not really little, but, like, for how much smoke was coming from it, it was pretty crazy. Like, when I first came over here and poured the bucket of water on the fire, so much smoke went in my face. So, yeah. Um, one more little look at it. That's the metal at the bottom, all the rocks, all the burnt wood, this burnt wood, burn mark, burnt rug, yeah, um, let's get right to the, uh, video.
night, and you're going to broken into again. Oh, no. Yep, they kicked. I was over here Friday night because I was out back having a couple beers in uh, uh, Antipurgo. Yeah, I was sitting out there, and uh, the light kept going on. So I went over, and it was a cat in the yard. So I didn't pay no mind to it. And he came over today. Back door and they sold his generator. Mm. So I told him if he's got any insurance on the house, he's like, no, he wouldn't even know. He goes, well, I thought it had some rhythm there and all that. And he said, no, as soon as you bought it, you should have got insurance. Mm. And then I know insurance. So I get there after the same ball morning and get the insurance on this house. What if it catches fire or a tree falls on it or something? You're not, you're out. So it burns slow. Oh, Thank God. I mean, yeah, it just would have went up quick if it was regular wood. Oh. I just happened to come out. I smelled the smoke, so I came out. Put the dogs out one last time before the night was over and got the end of the football game, go to sleep. And now that fire just don't look right over there. Yeah. I know you got your little bit, but I, I can see how long it was. It just don't look right. It's hard to build a new one. <laughs> what do you got, bricks? Um, yeah, a little bit of stone and bricks. Oh. <laughs> Did you sleep in? Yeah. I didn't mean to wake you up. Oh, thank but, hey, you. <laughs> this is uh.